Welcome back to Math Smash. I'm really glad you could join us. Okay, we're going to be calculating the volume of a cylinder. So what does volume mean? Well, volume means uh, the space take the amount of space taken up inside a closed shape, and we measure that in centimeters cubed or cubed units. All right, so let's get started by drawing our cylinder. All cylinders have a circular face at the one end and a circular face at the other. All right, and we'll need to identify pi. So pi, for our purposes in this video, are going to be 3.14. All right, and our radius is going to be identified by small r. All right, radius is we find the center of our circles here. We find the center of our bottom circle here and we draw a straight line from the center out to the outside edge of that circle and that is our radius. All right, now we go on to height and we again identify the center of the circle on top, draw a straight line down so that it meets the center in the bottom uh, circular face so that we create a right angle. Again, we start at the center, draw a straight line down to the center in the bottom circle, and then from the center, we draw a straight line out to the outside edge of that circle, creating a right angle. Okay? So, volume of a cylinder is going to be pi radius squared times the height, okay? So, uh, we start with 3.14, and let's say our uh, radius is, uh, let's say, two, and our height, let's say, is four. Okay, so we're going to square our radius, so that's gonna be two times two, and write in our height, which is four, and again, we have 3.14. 2 times 2 is 4, so multiplied by 4, multiplied by 4 again, that's our height. And again, 3.14 multiplied by 4 times 4 is 16. So 3.14 times 16 is going to give us 50.24 centimeters cubed. All right, that's very important. You must remember the cubed units. All right, I hope you found that helpful. Thanks very much for dropping by. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I hope to see you again soon. Have a great day.